match features and information matching is actually very easy but i just consume extra time do you have any strategy on this as to how to minimize the time i don't want to read it multiple times i want to read the paragraph from top to bottom only once and get all the answers correctly well if you are wondering then trust me today's video is for you because in this video i'll be explaining the complete strategies on how to save time how to do the match features and information matching in less time possible all you got to do is watch this video till the end hey everybody nakul from skills ielts really really hope everybody is doing fantastic i'm back with that another video today's video is all about ielts reading academic or general it doesn't matter both of it has this particular subject called match features and information matching so before we get into the video if not subscribe to this channel kindly click on the subscribe button and any point of time you need online assistance then online paid course you can text us to the number given there in the whatsapp i'll be there we will be there to help you guide you in the right direction all right so let's get into the video quickly without wasting any time so match information or um the information you know the match features or information matching look something like this where they'll give you big big paragraphs five six paragraphs usually will be there and uh, they'll give you some sentences all you got to do is identify which paragraph contains these sentences for example here the first question examples of wildlife other than bats which do not rely on vision to navigate by which of these a e b c d e which of these paragraphs contain this information sometimes they're going to give a feature sometimes they're going to give complete information so there is a way out there is a strategy what people go wrong here is they read from the beginning from the top a b c d e and try to find they keep on going in the loop because they'll not find the information again from the beginning they read they read they read this is very time consuming what if i tell you there is a way out but before that what i want uh today is i'm going to give you five uh, minute of a uh, timer you have to do this on your own and once five minute is done i'm going to come back and show you what mistakes you have done how to get the right approach and how you can solve this within 3 4 minutes easily so basically this video contains information in a way it makes you understand because i'm going to make you do the mistakes and then show you what mistakes you did why the mistake happened and all those things just a different way of approaching a problem All right, so I'm gonna start a timer, uh, five minute timer. Try to do it within five minutes. If you need more time, you can pause the video and do extra time. And once done, resume the video to understand the strategies.
all right i really hope you finished solving it so let me just help you with the correct approach uh, for information matching or match features the first thing first <laughs> the idea is very simple don't start dating a b c d a it's it's like you're trying to find some treasure no what is the treasure correct so you have to start reading first question second question third question fourth question fifth question six seven eight quickly and make a story you should know what you're searching for isn't it examples of wildlife so what you can do is you can just underline few of the things examples of wildlife other than bats if there is a paragraph contents information other than bats which do not rely on the vision they don't need light to navigate and that's the paragraph how early mammals avoid avoided dying out why bats hunt in the dark there should be a reason why bats hunt in the dark how a particular discovery some discovery some invention or have been mentioned there for what help our understanding of the bats so this way you will underline the things first it's okay it takes some time but you're going to do it a bit more quicker early military use i want the word military army some word about echolocation light is being used for enticing means attracting light is used basically for attracting opposite gender this process i want the word energy consuming one and some of some use the echoes caused by their own moment echo word using their own moment so we understood a lot of things many people tend to forget it immediately it's totally fine you can just you know grasp it again by you know revisiting the same lines that you have underlined wildlife other than bats early mammals why bats hunt in the dark a particular discovery helped our understanding of bats better military uses enticing the opposite gender energy consuming one and echoes caused by their their walking they are getting some echoes i have some understanding a fair understanding of what i need to look for without doing this the first line you read examples of wildlife and start searching searching it will not work it consumes a lot of time this is the first step now second step no cool i should start reading no 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 stop don't read it i'll tell you a simple strategy the entire thing is about bats we understood now when you start something about bats what will you talk do will you talk directly about the function the process no no you give some history bats are like this not only bats the early mammals so this early mammals probably comes in the first half wildlife rely on vision probably comes in the first half first half is a b if there are five paragraphs first half is a b c or a b c c half i need to look on the top i mean hope you are getting this is how you divide the things you would know in advance where it lies this line lies here this line lies here this you should know in advance by analyzing it from a distance we don't get too deep into the paragraph just reading the line you can figure out now why bats hunt in the dark probably this also will be in the first half because you started with the bats probably in the first half now you don't talk about discovery all of a sudden discovery comes after some time some introduction probably second half military uses and all probably second half light is being used for enticing the opposite gender this i am not sure because this has you no know, this is lacking clarity this process is an energy consuming one i'm not sure whenever you are not sure you leave it empty some use the echoes caused by their own movement so probably this is not bats this is not bats there is bat mentioned uh, the name would have mentioned so probably this is in the second half i'm just speculating this you should do within 25 or 30 seconds now we will read from the top and we look for these underlined words so don't read bats have a problem no we know what we need to look for see the first off first off wildlife early mammals why bats under the dark only three lines that i need to look for in the first half bats are a problem find their way the hunt at night and cannot use the light to find very sorry you might say this is the problem of the one that they could avoid simply by changing their habits and hunting by the day So don't you think it's already mentioned? It will continue. But the daytime economy is already heavily exploited. Given that there is a living to be made at night, and given that alternative day time trades are thoroughly occupied, natural selection has favored bats that make a go of the night hunting trade. Don't you think this is saying why bats would hunt in the night? Has favored bats that make a go of the night hunting trade. So why bats hunt in the dark? Probably this is a. 
hope you are getting it so now we'll continue it is probable that blah 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 nocturnal traits ancestry of all mammals somewhere we saw the early mammals in the time of dinosaurs is there anywhere else mammals used just to skim i see deep fish whales bacteria not much of mammal being mentioned i'm not sure but i think this is the mammals one sorry on that in the time when dinosaurs dominated the the mammalian ancestors probably managed to survive at all because they found ways of scraping so mammals has been mentioned but avoided the dying out do you have this information found ways of scraping a living scraping a living is you make a living that means you avoid dying out because the dinosaurs are all so big you cannot sustain if you go out hunting in the morning in the daytime so they avoided the daytime and how early mam mammals avoided dying out they started uh, you know searching for their prey in the night so this is also ye which is in the first half okay we'll continue bats have an engineering problem how to find their way and find their prey bats are not the only creatures to face this difficulty today obviously night flying insects so now another one 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 see there number one number one number one three one seven written out of which two we have already solved the parag the sentence one examples of wildlife other than bats which do not rely on vision to navigate by if you continue deep sea fish whales have little or no light fish and dolphins cannot see it's obstructed so don't you think this is what is talking about night flying insects that prey on must find their way about somehow first thing deep fish and whales have little or no light or by night so they don't have light they don't rely on the vision to navigate so don't you think this going to be b so the idea is simple one of the ways is identifying will it cover in the will it be covered in the first half or the second half and then finding finding the clues it's simple now two paragraphs a and b is done Pro probably a a b 1 2 3 is covered now the remaining particular discovery helped our understanding military uses light is being used for enticing other gender and process is an energy consuming one some of the echoes caused by their own movement we just have to find the phi in the rest three paragraph it is easy man we'll continue how to maneuver in the dark the first one that might occur to him to is to manufacture light we are not talking about manufacturing the light have the power to manufacture we don't want this manufacturing but the process seems to consume a large amount of hey we came across this large amount of energy somewhere is an energy consuming one this gonna be c is it easy fireflies use the light for attracting oh, <laughs> mates attracting mates enticing the opposite gender this gonna be c out of 8 5 done another 3 another 2 3 paragraphs are there don't you think it's becoming more easier so the bigger problem we are dividing into smaller one five paragraphs we divided into two paragraphs first half second half oh i think this will come in the first half oh this will come in second half i mean hope you are getting the bigger problem we are dividing them into smaller one and merging divide and conquer basically if you're an engineer if you studied computer science you would know divide and conquer alg algorithm works on the similar principle all right we'll continue since our eyes are exposed directly to the light source however using light to find one sphere requires vastly more energy that we have already talked blind people without being aware are using their echoes of their own footsteps somewhere footsteps somewhere movement this gonna be d hope you are getting and i'm just take this off so that it looks neat hold on for a second okay so the idea is another two are left which may not be that difficult um, so we have finished uh, number one number two number three number six number seven number eight four or five left <laughs> we need a particular discovery and military so we are in this paragraph for example to measure the depth of the sea under the ship after this technique had been invented it was only a matter of time weapons weapons weapon designers probably we're talking we are converging to the military uses uh, detection of submarine military uses both sides in the second world war relied heavily on this devices under some different different code names which uses radio echoes rather than sound echoes can we take this up military uses of echolocation military use we saw echolocation we have not so it's confusing what do we do we leave it empty and continue 
the sonar we have left with this particular discovery as helped it should be you only man because i did not see a b c d talking about how a particular discovery has helped our understanding of the patch it should be somewhere in here you see here scientific understanding of details of bats are doing has come from applying the radar theory radar theory is the where is that discovery understanding of the bats understanding of the details of the bats hope you are getting it so we are left with one hold on for a second so how a particular theory will be e one second so this is going to be e okay clear early military uses of echolocation okay it's obviously not in the first of we can just scrap it d or e d we saw military submarines wars and all was there e we will see the sonar and radar pioneers means founders didn't know it then but the world now knows the bad selections has perfected the system military military is not come here it is sonar but the underlying mathematical theories are very similar much of our scientific understanding of bats are come from applying uh, the american zoologist it is not for military use who was largely responsible for the discovery of sonar coined the term echolocation he coined the term but military uses of echolocation is different so obviously it is not e echolocation he coined the term to cover both sonar radar see here radio and sounder sonar is sound navigation and ranging uh, radar is i think radio navigation and ranging that is radio echo sound echo this is a military one detection of submarine so this has to be d so from my experience this is where people go wrong they see the word and go after it don't chase don't go behind something just because the word is matching the context should match so let me just recapitulate the answers the first question answer lies in the paragraph b second and third lies in the paragraph a fourth lies in the paragraph e fifth lies in the paragraph d not e sixth lies in the paragraph c seventh lies in the paragraph c and eighth own moment this lies in the paragraph blind people d do leave a comment as to how much marks you have got what approach you followed and do let me know in the comment section if this approach is good enough to solve most of the questions in less time now the next step is you can go to any website take up a question or a cambridge book take up a question and apply this divide a bigger thing into smaller thing converge things will be automatically falling in place and the, that golden number of the, that magic just unfolds all right guys i really hope this session helped you with this i'll park it here this is nakul from skill siles keep watching skill siles subscribe to our channel without fail if not and if any point of time need an online assistance it's a paid course you can text us in the whatsapp like this there are more than 300 reading mocks we have more than probably 100 different questions like this and the strategy so don't delay your success any point of time you need assistance you can text us with this i'll park it here guys thanks so much for your time take care bye bye